So the motivation of studying biology is to understand the cause of and to identify the cure of all diseases. A diseased state can be defined as the one in which a system fails to function properly. The human body has different levels of organization within itself and at the base of these levels lies cell which is the fundamental unit of life. Individual cells they come together for the good of an entire organism and this coming together is what we call as communication between the cells. The communication between the cells is mediated by special class of molecules which we call as proteins and studies have shown over and over again that it is the failure of function of these molecules that leads to diseases at all these levels of organizations. Scientists have understood this concept well and they have utilized this information in drug designing. Most of the FDA approved drugs, they target proteins. But we don't have cure for all diseases yet and that's the problem. And the reason is that we have about 47,000 proteins in a cell and each protein interacts with 20 more proteins and those 20 proteins will interact with 20 more further downstream for a variety of different reasons. Thus creating a giant network of this interaction between different protein molecules within a cell. The specificity within this interaction network is achieved through specific regions in the proteins called as motifs highlighted in color in this image. The preliminary studies in our lab have shown that when these motifs are present in a specific region of protein called as the C-terminus tail, it imparts functionality to that protein. So if you chop off that region, the protein will not perform its function. And each protein has only one C-terminal region. Now based on these observations, we asked to what extent the C-terminus tail is being exploited by these proteins functionally. And our hypothesis is it's to a very great extent. To test our hypothesis, we generated a list of potential C-terminal motifs in all the human proteins of a cell and then to test our predictions, we used from that pool of novel motifs a few to test experimentally using techniques such as mass spectrometry. All this information has been consolidated into and will be updated in our web application, the c terminome which is freely available to everyone. The end goal is to be able to generate these protein networks for each protein in a cell so that we can infer the potential drug targets for any diseased state. Thank you.